Well, greetings everybody. Joseph, Green Mountain Gold Trap. And guess where I am? I'm at the store. No, I'm at the bank. <laughs> Today is my mom's birthday. Happy birthday, mom. I love you. <laughs> so, we're going to do some digging. Why do I say we? Well, I have company. Somebody who's never been gold prospecting before. And he happens to be my neighbor. There goes a big herring. I hope I got that on video. But this is Nick. Everybody say hello to Nick in comments because oddly enough, before I invited him to come and then I told him who I was, he said that he had already seen my channel and watched some of my videos. So I don't know, do you have, do you have the ability to comment on videos? Yes. Oh, you do. So everybody say hi to Nick. He's a good kid. All right, so we are going to, y'all know this hole that I dug out. It's right here in front of this, this big bedrock. Well, basically this is a fault zone. Well, there's no basically about it. I mean, it's common sense. So in front of and behind of objects, gold will drop out. We're not gonna find much gold out in here, but this hole I dug, I didn't bother with any of these big boulders, so I wanna get these out of the way and put them over in here. We'll dig this. And then, Nick kicked that rock down and I'm thinking, hmm, we need to go in here too. So I wanna get in front of this. That, I don't know how big that's gonna be. Probably pretty big. I gotta get that out of the way. So, I gotta get out there and get wet and rebuild my wing dam and get a set up. So we'll get back to you in a little bit. Catch you soon. still at it and Hung's up there somewhere she showed up a while ago it's been quite a while since I shot the first clip check this out we've moved a whole lot Nick's been a great help having a good time and we are finding gold I just did a test pan and found a chunky piece. I should have showed it to you before I sucked it up in the snuffer bottle. <laughs> but you just get so excited you want to keep going. Got the wing dam built. And I see the plastic is... Well, we still got good flow, so it don't matter. Oh, all right. Where's Hung? There she is. Hiding behind the boulder. <laughs> Back to work. Well, I'm on a teeter totter. Okay, catch you in a bit. All right, so we got this spot cleaned out really good. I hooked the suction hand dredge up, cleaned that bottom out. Just ran the bucket that I sucked up with the suction hand dredge. And now we're gonna do a clean out because Nick wants to get home. But I think I'm, I'm not done for the day. We live close enough where I'm just going to bring him home and I'll leave that gold trap setting right there and uh, come back and do some more. I want to dig over in here too. Work this material. That's going to be fun, moving that thing. But I should be able to roll it right over in here easy. All right, so we're going to do a clean out. 
and see what we get. Alright, we got her cleaned out. Pan's just not going to want to stay in one spot. Nice. Got 74 pieces. See if we can get that fanned out a little bit. Nice glare. Not too bad. And we've only we've only been here for what? Maybe Four hours digging, yeah. probably. Did you have fun, Nick? Yeah. You like gold? Yeah. Everybody likes gold. Puts a smile on your face. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to bring Nick home. I'm going to leave stuff here. And then I'm coming back because I'm not done. All right. Catch you all in a bit. So Nick's happy. Definitely am. Get somewhere else. A little something for him to take home <laughs> and show off to his friends or whatever. So, you think you'd probably go find gold again? <laughs> you might have the fever now gold fever. <laughs> All right. So that's, con that's going to conclude next time with me, but like I said, I'm coming back. Home's still up there working. I got to let her know I'm leaving my stuff here and I'll be back. So I made it back. Had a good time. Nick's a good kid. He's a good kid. And any uh, a message to you would be uh, bullies out there. I'm a friend of Nick's, and he's a friend of mine, and I don't take too kindly to bullying. So I'd appreciate it if you leave him alone. You know, you're better off uh, making friends with people because later in life, being a bully can kick you right in the butt. So uh, you might want to think twice. But Nick's a good kid, so. Really had a good time. He really enjoyed himself. Nick, thank you for coming, and uh, hopefully you come again. So I'm gonna keep working this. Get me some gold. I'm gonna work it further that way now. Okay, so this is where Nick and I work, and I just uncovered all of that. Look at all them little pockets and crevices in there. Sadly, there's no way to suck it out. I got down as far as I could just with my shovel. And I'm hoping to get back here before any major storms and continue this. That's a pretty big boulder. That was a pretty big boulder. Pry bar helped me get it out of the way. That was sitting up here. So, I am about to do my final clean out of the day, we already got the uh, water blocked off on the skid plate. Pan in place, ready to go. So I'll let you know what happens. All right, I'm basically all picked up. I got the plastic out of the wing dam. You don't want to leave that in place. If it should rain and water rises, well, that's just more junk downstream. We don't want that. Got that folded up and over there and ready to go. And I got my last clean out pan, another 37 pieces. And the biggest piece of the day in this one.
focusing as usual. Seems like every time I do this, y'all get to hear me say that. But that's a pretty decent piece right there. If I could get it without a shadow. Okay. Got all my stuff up there ready to go. And I'm out of here. Thank y'all for watching. Thank you to my subscribers. And those of you who haven't subscribed, please feel free to do so. And like, share, and comment. And I'll catch you later. Green, Mac, Green Mountain Gold Trap is out of here for the day. Take care.